Hi everyone, Dr. Rebecca Lewis, Chief Medical Officer at St. Mary's Regional Hospital, talking to you today about heart health and heart disease. February is uh, National Heart Month, and so there's always a big emphasis on making sure that we're doing what we can to help protect your heart health. So heart disease is the leading cause of death in both men and women in the United States. More than 20 million people in the U.S. have heart disease. With that, uh, one in five deaths in America are related to heart disease, and that comes out to be one person dying from heart disease every 34 seconds. So heart disease and prevention of heart disease is very important uh, for everybody. The people that we really wanna focus on heart disease are going to be the ones who have more heart disease risk factors. So some of those will include family history of heart disease, especially if there's somebody in your family who had heart disease before the age of 50. Um, if you're overweight or obese, if you have any medical conditions like high blood pressure, high cholesterol, diabetes, if you are eating a diet that's high in processed foods or having um, an excess in alcohol consumption, or if you're a smoker, those are all things that significantly increase your risk of heart disease. So when it comes to heart disease and prevention, um, as you can see the, through those risk factors, with the exception of family history, a lot of them are ones that we can do things to change to really decrease that risk of heart disease, um, which then would help decrease your risk of heart attack and decrease your risk of stroke. So the things that we tell you to do are making sure that your diet is very well balanced, lots of fruits and vegetables, whole grains, limiting your uh, processed foods and limiting your sodium, trying not to take in a lot of excess sugar, especially in things like sodas and drinks that are, are loaded with sugar, um, and then making sure that you are limiting the processed uh, foods and oils as much as possible. Um, and then alcohol as well, just limiting that to no more than one drink per night if you're a female and two drinks per night if you're a male. The um, other things that are important are getting a lot of exercise in. The average recommendation is 150 minutes of moderate exercise a week, so that could be five nights a week of 30 minutes, or um, doing 75 minutes a week of intense exercise. So if you're somebody who does more intense aerobic exercise, you could get by with longer or shorter exercises, um, less frequently uh, if, it's, if it's more intense. Um, the other big thing is going to be smoking and, and quitting smoking if you're currently a smoker. So if you do smoke, doing whatever you can to help, your doctor can often help you and be your partner in that. Um, different medications, different things like patches and gum that we can help with to help decrease that risk through that. So if you're thinking that you're somebody who is high risk for heart disease, go ahead and make these lifestyle changes and contact your physician today to see what else you can do to help decrease your risk.